I call the honourable member, Jonathan Young. Mr Speaker, I'm very pleased to uh, stand and speak on the uh, GCSB and related legislation amendment bill. And uh, thank you for your attention, sir, and uh, the remarks of the previous speaker, who I'm sure would be a great author of a conspiracy novel, because that's what it sounded like. You know, we need to understand that the safety and security of this nation is dependent upon organisations such as this, and we need to understand that they must have uh, a strong, clear legal framework in which they operate. New Zealanders expect that. New Zealanders expect this government to provide security and safety to its citizens, and it is important that we have agencies who can assist and do this uh, in a way that is appropriate. The 2003 Act sought to codify and make transparent existing practices of the then GCSB, but under scrutiny, the 10-year-old Act potentially limits the GS. Uh, GCSB's ability to provide the support and advice that successive governments expect and have expected, and possibly limit uh, current support and advice that can be pr provided. And so it's important and it's a responsible thing for this government to do uh, to move to clarify the Act. This bill will make the GCSB Act clearer and more transparent so it is clear what the agency can and cannot do. Uh, Mr Speaker, the functions and resourcing of the Inspector General of Intelligence of his office uh, will be increased and improved. That will increase capability and enable them to have increased scrutiny over the operations of this agency. So, Mr Speaker, the GCSB has a crucial role to play in protecting the security, safety and the best interests of New Zealand and New Zealanders. And so it's for this reason that this Act, uh, after the compliance review uh, by Rebecca Kitteridge, uh, is, uh, this bill is progressing in order to uh, bring those improvements, uh, to bring the improvements of oversight mechanisms that apply to our uh, intelligence community. So I'm very happy to support uh, the, the progression of this bill in the House. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I call the Right Honourable Winston Peters. Uh, Mr Speaker.